Hello and good evening, citizens. I am your host, Black Prion. Now, as we all know, I'm an avid reader, and I love to break videos on injustice. And due to some family troubles, I haven't been able to do either. So circumventing this issue, I will be doing all two at the same time. Multitasking. Also, I'll be throwing in a little obnoxious, ripscallious rap music into the mix as well. So without further ado, let's begin. Down to Trey Grab. Chapter 18 of the Illyrian Destiny by Nicholas Doer. I see, Arian. But what is that orange light? Callus asked as he returned to exit the wheel. He had come back from searching out of the bridge's window for the, from the famous port of town. He had no idea what to do after he had found it. The blonde youth glanced at him from the helm. Light. I wonder if that could be Kyle? The mercenary watched him for only a moment, then went back to look out of the window. I'm thinking we should perhaps move in a little closer so I can get a definite on that. If it is, I don't know if I'll be accepted by him, let alone if he is enough able to trouble himself with my sit already. X nodded and eased his foot off the pedal, halting the fans and allowing them to slow further. It took a few of those, uh, I can't say, huh? Finally, he stepped on another pedal. He had recently discovered, which made the fan speed increase in moderation, very similar to the layout on a boat. The ship groaned slightly to his request, but complied and lowered the altitude slightly while increasing its speed. After a few moments, Kala snickered slightly and reported, it's Sid, Kyle. Your brother resists and resists his death. Pay the master back for what he did to my own men. Speak for yourself. I have no, no intentions of going back. I have my own reasons to hate it. I don't know why I switched from Bane to Christopher Walken, but we're gonna roll with that. The inheritor of the nuts, i he's a wicked family member, Callus. Sting directly over to Ariel. What? He shouted back. I don't know how to control this beast. All you have to do is simply steer the wheel. It's a boat in the sky. All right, time is short. X then left it to the man without response and ran to the door. That led back to the deck. I know this is probably not the best thing to do, but I need to help Kyle, even if I can't reach him. He then opened the door that led outside and nearly flew off. Hey, say, huh? hey, say, stomp him in the nuts, I'ma stomp him in the nuts. Luckily, the glass cabin, most of the wind, away from the door. X stepped out and pulled the door behind him closed. Hey, say, huh? hey, say, stomp him in the nuts, I'ma sure. Any more openings? He charged the frozen beast and ripped his blade from its torso. Garden body fall to pieces. It crumbled to the floor and turned to vapor, giving off cooling dew on the entire floor. It became an extremely uncomfortable atmosphere for the room. X fell into the ground, and at that juncture, he just decided to lay there. The burns along his side and chest were excruciatingly painful. They were nothing compared to the wounds of the fallen beast. Nothing more. Physically and mentally at his limit, he knew it was for the best to let the redder flashes of darkness take the better of him. And at that juncture, he only needed rest for a little while. 
I don't know why I got into this Rachel Alucard voice for Blaze Blue out of nowhere. It sucks ass, but whatever. Callus slept in for the first time in weeks. He was a weaker man. When he woke, he got dressed as quickly as possible. Momentarily forgetting. Hey, to say, huh? Hey, to say, Stomp him in the nuts. I'm gonna stomp him in the nuts. Down when he realized he was in a friendly castle. No missions. He was in no danger. With a loud. <sighs> Yawn. Guess it's contagious even in. Hey, to say, huh? This was an involuntary habit he had grown accustomed to. There came no sounds or movements of any kind. Realizing that there was no other place he had. Hey, to say, huh? Hey, to say, Stomp him in the nuts. Sounds or movements of any kind. Realizing that there was no other place he had. Hey, to say, huh? Stomp him in the nuts, I'ma stomp him in the nuts. Realizing that there was no other place he had to be, he thought. He would hey, to say, huh? Hey, to say, huh? Stomp him in the nuts, I'ma stomp him in the nuts. He would feel better if he just visited the king. As he marched down the main hall up into the double doors of the king's audience chamber, a young soldier who was accompanied by an older one stopped him. And that's where we'll end off the reading there, guys. Uh, if the footage is still going of me just trait grabbing people, yeah. Uh, the point of this video was I haven't listened to my rap music, done my reading, or played Injustice. So I really haven't been doing anything that I like due to a death in the family. So I figured I'd just do all three at the same time and try to have fun and do something stupid crazy. Uh, I'll probably do never do this video idea again because, I don't know, it's like 8 in the morning and like I haven't slept yet. So I've been up for like... 26 hours or something like that so my mind is like Psh. and you can probably tell by me not wording some things correctly trust me it's not worded that horribly in the book in some places so yeah uh y'all have a good day and an even better tomorrow i'm the black prion and i'm out